Hey y'all, it's Jamie Dean. I'm here at Mama's house today sharing another recipe with you. And I gotta laugh. We're doing twice baked potatoes. And look, it, you have got to be careful not to go too far to the edge. You really wanna make sure that you leave some potato here. This is a lesson that I learned the hard way. You think you can get all the potato out, but you wind up tearing up the jacket and you don't wanna do that. Thanks for tuning in today. We're doing twice baked potatoes. It is a really way to kind of make a, a simple food a little bit more elegant and the possibilities are endless. I've seen it done with broccoli and shrimp, steak and cheese twice baked potatoes. We used to sell those at a place I worked at in college. Today we're doing bacon with chives, a little bit of cheese and some fresh butter. This is so simple y'all. We have got four potatoes that we've cooked off and I've scraped these out and see if you, like this one, I got a little close and you can poke through the bottom of this jacket and you really don't want to. All of this is gonna combine together and it, so do not worry about, in fact, you must leave a little bit of potato on the skin or it'll never hold together. So one of the secrets for our twice baked potatoes is just like, well, this is just a fully loaded baked potato is all this is. I'm gonna add some sour cream to it Maybe, uh, that's probably a quarter of a cup. Jamie, one thing I didn't put out for you was salt. Oh, that's, that's okay, I'll get the salt. Okay. And we're gonna add, I've got a half a stick of butter here. That's kind of really nice and soft. We've got our bacon, and I'm gonna reserve a little bit of this for the top. We've got our cheese that I wanna get mixed up in there. I tell you, I've made these so many times for my family and through our business and everything, I'm really not checking the recipe. So if the recipe that you see down there doesn't match up with the one that I'm doing, or maybe they'll fix it to look like exactly what I'm doing. Y'all know me, I will change a recipe in a hot second. And as long as it stays true to the what the recipe is, if you wanna add some onions in here. Oh, onions will be so good down in there. I love onions in my potatoes. Or whatever you wanna do. Pinch of salt, pinch of pepper. Now, I wouldn't take, if you wanted to, you could, but there's no sense in breaking out your hand mixer for this, y'all. We're gonna mix this up. This almost looks like a creamed potato if I added a little bit of warm milk. So you choose, what do you wanna do? Do you have any leftover steak? Do you have any leftover chicken? Do you have your vegetables? You got something fresh coming out of your garden? Anything that you can eat with a potato. My mom's secret potato sauce is half sour cream, half mayonnaise with raw onions, with Vidalia onions. It is so good. Anything you want, but today, this is how we're gonna do it. Now you just fill this baby up. Look at that. See how simple that is? The hardest part's waiting around and um, scooping them out. And not just because you wanna be careful not to go too deep into the jacket, but because they're gonna be hot. Y'all want to scoop your potatoes out while they're still warm from the oven, because if it cools off, they'll just come out in bigger chunks. So I've got two out of my eight. Y'all come right back and we'll be done. We'll finish them up. Okay, y'all, look at here. Mm -mm. So I saved a little bit of bacon. So I'll put just some on the top, just to kind of give it a little texture and color, not too much, because we worked it all on the inside. Let me give you another little tip about making your baked potato special. Rub them down with olive oil, and then put some kosher salt around the outside. It makes the skin so good. So you rub them with oil, kosher salt, wrap them in full, put them in the oven. We got our little bit of vegetables, because you cannot live on starch alone. This will add a little bit of flavor and it also adds that really pretty color. This is basically a jacked up potato skin, I guess. It's better than a potato skin. It's a twice baked potato, y'all. We're going in the oven, we're coming out of the oven, and we're going in my mouth. Stick around. Looky here. Now, we've already cooked them, so remember when you put these back into the oven, you just want to reheat everything and get your cheese melted. So it's only 10 or 12 minutes probably in the oven. So if you want more cheese on here, do you see how, there's plenty of cheese in here, but you can see the chives, you can see the bacon. 
I don't really like to cover it with an orange shredded cheese because it just looks like a pile of cheese on top of a potato. I really like to see what I'm getting. So if you want to, you can add more cheese to it. It's up to you. If this is up to me, I'm eating. These are twice baked potatoes, y'all. I'm Jamie Dean. Thanks for joining me today in the kitchen. Ooh. Mm-mm. Mm. mm. Hey y'all, it's Paula Dean. Now, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to like it and click the subscribe button as well as the notification bell to be alerted when I post a video. Love and best dishes, y'all.